Yo, what is going on you guys? So today we're going to be going over all of the new changes uh, with the new Fortnite update, the 7.20 patch. Uh, so there's the new scope revolver, uh, the new redeploying gliders, there's a whole bunch of stuff we're going to be going over in this video. Um, so before I dive into that, just real quick, if you guys could go down below, hit that subscribe button and or the like button, I would really appreciate it. And lastly, my supporter creator code. 2NDSUXX in the Fortnite item shop. If you guys could type that in, even if you want to use it just for two weeks and use somebody else's, it would really, really help me out and I would be so grateful. Uh, but anyways, let's get into the video. Alright guys, so the first thing I'm going to start off with, obviously the new weapon, the Scopes Revolver. Um, it looks pretty sweet, but um, I don't know if it's going to be worth picking up. I mean, that's really up to you guys. So this is what it looks like. Um, so this is available in epic and legendary variants you could get it from floor loot, chests, supply drops, and vending machines so as you can see there are six rounds in each um, or six shots before you have to reload um, as far as what it does to material I'll put some wood here it doesn't destroy wood in one shot like a deagle would so I'll wait for that to build So it actually needs four shots before it can destroy a piece of wood. So not not so great for materials. Um, but as far as the damage, the epic does 42 damage per shot, and legendary does 44 damage per shot. Now, the thing about this weapon is that there's no bullet drop off, so it's like the deagle. Um, no matter where you're aiming, as long as you know where the red dot is, that's where it's the the bullet's gonna go. Um, so I'm going to shoot this as fast as I can, just so you can see, you know, the speed of it and how fast it can actually fire. Alright, so that was me just, you know, spamming R2. So obviously there's a huge kick to this weapon. Um, you know, say there's someone running across. It's kind of hard to get the reticle back on top of the person. Um... But, you know, if I'm, I'm sure if you get, like, a headshot or something, it'll do some serious damage. Me, personally, I don't know if this weapon is going to be worth picking up. Um, but let me know what you guys think. I'm going to try and get some gameplay for you guys. The reason I did this in creative mode is just because there's so much I want to cover in today's video. I just wanted to do it, you know, as quick as I possibly can. Show you guys the weapon and how it fires. Um, so that's pretty much it for the Scopes Revolver. Um, so now let's move on to the other stuff. Alright you guys, so the next thing I'm going to show you is pretty insane. This just got added uh, today after the update. This huge ice ball thing uh, right over Polar Peak. I'm going to stop talking just for a couple of seconds just so you guys can hear because there's actually an audio effect. Okay, so that's like an ice version of Kevin or something. I don't even know. Um, so this was, like I said, this was just added after the last update. I'm pretty sure this is going to turn into another event. I honestly can't even give an opinion or a theory as to what will happen with this. Um, actually, no, no, I can't. So some stuff was leaked by um, on Twitter Lucas 7 Yoshi I'm sure you guys know of him he's a, uh, a Fortnite leaker data miner um, but there's an event that's going to be coming called Mooney um, but even if it's not this there's an also more leaks with some signs that say weather warning uh, you know breaking news and it shows like a bunch of snow and wind on the map stuff like that um, there's like a picture of like the tier 100 skin that says no signal so I feel like that'll be on the TVs when the event happens um, so I feel like some kind of huge weather storm is gonna happen you know in this area um, there are some other things that I know about I just don't want to spoil them right now um, but I'll definitely within the next week or two I'll be able to upload that um, I just don't want to you know give away too much at once for you guys and spoil it but this is definitely going to be an event 
I'm very certain of that. And um, I feel like it'll be related to the weather storm that's going to be coming into the game. I'm not sure what exactly is going to happen. All I know is I have like pictures. Like I said, if you want to check out the pictures, feel free to check out my Twitter. Um, or I, like I said, Lucas7Yoshi is the one who hooked me up with this. So, so that's pretty much that. Um, so now for the next piece on the 7.20 update. As you can see in my inventory, I have a picture of a glider with 50 uses. Now, I'm trying to look around and see if there's another one laying around. This is only in playground mode where it gives you one uh, right off the bat. So I'll show you real quick. Say I'm up here. As you can see, it says 50. That's the amount of uses that I have for the glider. Now if I jump off and use it you know, simply just like that, it goes to 49. Now, if you find one of these in an actual game, you only get 10 uses. So, I don't really know if it's worth picking up. Um, balloons also changed to uh, the blue rarity instead of purple. I don't know what the big deal about that is. But anyways, um, so yeah, the glider redeploy. You know, obviously, the negative part of it is that it takes up a whole inventory slot. I mean, I have enough trouble as it is trying to, you know, figure out, okay, so there's one right here. I have enough trouble as it is trying to figure out, you know, what I want in my inventory, like, oh, do I take the RPG or the sniper? I don't know. Um, so say I pick up another one, it goes to 10, because that's what you would normally find in a game, um, and every time you use it, you'll use, you know, a charge or a use of it. See, so it just went down to 9. Um, the reason it was at 50 is only because I'm in playground mode. That's the only reason why. And obviously you can only pick up one. Until you run out, then you could pick up another one. I personally don't think that I'll be picking up the redeployable glider. Just because, you know, th there's balloons now and stuff like that. Um, but things like jump pads, rifts, uh, those will not count towards uses for the redeploy glider. Um, so I'm pretty sure that's it. And the redeploy glider you could find on the, on the ground. Um, you can find them in llamas, supply drops, just, you know, the normal. Uh, so anyways, let's move on. Alright, so some of the stuff I can't show in the actual video, just because I think Epic Games would be a little mad. I know they're cracking down on leaks and stuff like that. Um, but as you can see from the thumbnail, there's a few leaked skins, um, which are actually pretty cool, I'm not going to lie. The skins, I haven't been a huge fan of lately. Um, but the one, and these are only a few... Uh, I think there's eight total leaked skins. Again, if you want to check those out, just head over to my Twitter. Um, but, you know, the skins aren't looking too bad. Um, none of them are the Snowfall skin. I thought they were going to be, but I guess not. Probably next week or the week after that. Um, but one thing, and I obviously can't show it just because, like I said, I think Epic will be mad and it's not in the game yet. But there's going to be a new consumable. I don't know when. There's no exact date, um, but there's a new consumable called Sneaky Snowman, um, and this is pretty much, you know, Bush 2.0. So basically, if you find the Sneaky Snowman, um, if you want to see a picture, you can just head over to my Twitter. Um, but the description for it is a portable snowman disguise. So once you use it, you're just going to turn into a snowman. So I don't think there's actually any snowman on the map at all so I'm assuming that when they release it there will be uh, like you know snowmen where bushes are or they'll just add them into the game on top of the bushes I'm not really sure all I know that is this consumable is coming and it's called sneaky snowman and it says a portable snowman disguise that's pretty much it um, real quick I just want to get like a closer look at this ice thing it's pretty high up there. Um, what else? What else? I'm trying to think. What else? I don't want to miss anything. Man, this thing is high up. Look at this thing, man. This is what? I can't even build right here? I guess this is the top. Oh no! Uh, go back, go back, go back. Sorry about that, guys. I don't know if I just can't build 
near this thing or if I'm at the top I can't really tell but anyway I just wanted to like actually look inside yeah I can't build anywhere here damn is this really the top? oh I guess so okay um <clears throat> so I don't know I can't really see anything inside I don't know let me know if you guys see anything at all in the comments but this just looks like a regular ice ball I'm um, as so my opinion is that this uh this storm event is inside this ball and uh once the event happens you know there'll just be chaos and the whole map is going to be like all snowy and windy um that's just my guess for now I don't really know it's hard to guess you know um there's a lot of theories on reddit about what's going to happen but all I know is that there's an event called Mooney. Uh, I know that there's going to be a huge weather snowstorm that's going to happen. Um, and like I said, I know a couple other things that I'll go over in a different video. But um, I'm pretty sure that's it. Uh, oh, one more thing. Building sensitivity. So as you can see, they added like an extra number. <laughs> so you can like pinpoint the exact sensitivity that you want. Um, and I guess that the... Um, the edit sensitivity is also the same as whatever your building sensitivity is now um, which is down here like I said they add an extra number so you can I guess it skips it's only odd numbers that's weird anyways um, that's one other thing um, a few other things from the patch notes minigun adjustments uh, would you like to save that? Don't save. No, I don't want to do that. Uh, so minigun adjustments. So now the minigun actually overheats, um, just like the planes would. Uh, they reduced the wind-up time by 37%. Updated the audio. Um, what else? And just like other, you know, things that don't really matter. Like the balloons changed from epic to rare. Stink bomb changed from epic to rare. Um, scoped AR decreased from rare to epic to uncommon to rare. Um, you know, just stuff like that. I guess that stuff doesn't really matter because you'll find that in the game anyway. Um, don't think there's anything else. Um, hmm. Oh, I'm sorry. I think I made, uh, no, no, okay. I was just reading wrong. Never mind. Don't listen to me. Um, I'm sorry this is kind of like rambling, um, but I just wanted to go over everything important with you guys with this new update, um, and I'm pretty sure I covered everything. If I did miss anything, make sure you guys just leave it in the comments, or if there's any map changes you guys notice, uh, feel free to tag me in it on Twitter. Um, also, you know, if you guys are using my supporter creator code, feel free to send me a screenshot on Twitter. I'll retweet it, uh, post it. You know, I really appreciate when you guys use my code and uh, buy something in the item shop with it. Re what the heck? Oh, I thought that was something. My bad. Um, but yeah, I really appreciate when you guys use my code. I really, really do. Um, so anyways, I guess I'm going to wrap up this video. Um, I thought I was going to have a lot more material to cover, but if I think of anything else, I'll throw it down in the comments. But for now, that's going to be it. So again, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Uh, again, if you're not subscribed, if you could, I would really, really appreciate it. We're so close to 6,000 subscribers. That's all I want. Um, my main goal on this channel, if you guys are new, is just to hit 100,000 subscribers. I know I'm really far from that, but that's just my goal. I, I want that more than anything in the world right now. So if you guys can help me get there, I would really, really appreciate it. Um, so anyways, I'm gonna end this. I hope you guys have a great day.